So, in this specific place where I am, uh, this, is, uh, this is the most common tree. It's called Wangwangwenyi. Uh, it's an acacia tree, and it's it's just average in the growth. Uh, it grows not so slowly, uh, and it's not the fastest ones either. And uh, I expect it to be a bit can be a bit old, but usually in, in this place uh, they're not so old. Maybe this one is 15, 20 years as as the most. Um, and uh, I've only find like one or two that is like a hundred years old, very big. So this one is a very interesting tree um, for me because uh, I, I really the first trees I want to plant are are, are nitrogen fixes. They are trees that that grows quick uh, and it's very good. With this tree is uh, because it's a thorny tree. It's very good because of uh, with the Ma people keeping a lot of livestock. Uh, those those twigs and and branches are very useful for fencing, um, and uh, it is uh, even even if animals enters to where I planted trees, they can grow. They can grow because they have those thorns. They can protect themselves a bit. From from being eaten by 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 the goats and the sheep and the, and the cow. So it's a nice tree, um, and uh, right now it's giving seeds. So it's an opportunity for me to collect those seeds and uh, try to 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 read about, understand how to plant it. Um, but generally, with with acacia. Um, it is it is good to to plant. Uh, it is good to. Oi, Eva. It is good to collect uh, this this the seeds as they are dry, uh, and uh, they are the perfect time is when when the pod has opened, and uh, they can be stored for some time. And then they are quite hard. So generally, what they, what they say with acacias is, is they need to be like cut a bit so that this hard surface gets open a bit so the moisture can get inside. And then if you want to put it in a nursery bed, you can you can put it in water. You can boil water. You can put it, and you do that for a few days, uh, and then you you can put it in your nursery bed and it grows well. Me, I, I might might not put it in a nursery bed, but um, I'll still cut it so that it gets uh, gets an opportunity to get that moisture, and then I will sow them just like beans in those places I want to, to plant them. So uh, the acacias, there are several trees that I that I want to to plant as seeds directly, and uh, the, the nitrogen fixing trees, the acacias, the fast growing trees. And we will see, that is my, my vision, and we will see how far I will come. So these trees are good, uh, also this, these pods are eaten by, by, by goats. Uh, so it is a good thing for me to have around, <laughs> as, it, uh, as it gives food uh, for those animals. Also for humans, the inner bark is consumable, it's sugary and it seems to be a bit medicinal to the throat uh, and it's nice. And also bark can be used and roots can be used for, for soup um, and I'm yet to understand uh, the benefits of it. So, hope you learned something new.